Right now, President Biden is here in San Diego and he's getting ready to speak. Yeah, any moment. President Biden is scheduled to arrive at Viasat. It's a tech company based out of Carlsbad. He's also expected to deliver remarks. CBS 8's Kelly Hessedal joining us live from Viasat right now. Kelly, what's going on there? That's right, and we're about 10 minutes away from the uh, president uh, taking the stage here, so we're all anxiously waiting for that to happen. If you take a look around here at this crowd, a lot of folks out here, and many of the people that you see over here, uh, Viasat employees, many are uh, military veterans, and actually Congressman Mike Levin just finished uh, talking on stage to the crowd a short time ago, uh, talking about the importance of finding veterans' jobs. Uh, uh, more than 10% of the workforce here at Viasat uh, is our veterans, so they're eager to to hear what the president has to say. Uh, take a listen to some of what was said last night at a rally in Oceanside. You got to remember who in God's name we are. We are the United States of America, for God's sake. There's nothing, not a single thing in the world we can't do if we do it together. Not one single thing. For the environment. And so there you saw the president firing up the crowd at Miracosta College last night, uh, trying to rally voters to cast their ballots. Now, he was there in support of Congressman Mike Levin, who's in a tight race for re-election. Uh, the first row of people here at this uh, event is our San Diego leaders, including Chair Nathan Fletcher, Mayor Todd Gloria. And according to the White House, Viasat was chosen for the president's visit today because it's one of the tech companies that's going to benefit from the president's Chips and Science Act, a $280 billion legislative package. Uh, meant to boost semiconductor manufacturing here in the United States and to create more high-tech jobs. Now, I'm sure we're going to hear him talk about that today. Uh, the president really sees this as one of his big successes. And, of course, the Democrats want to focus on uh, successes, that their, successes, that is, that their party has had going into the midterm elections, uh, which are just next week. So back out here live, you see this crowd out here waiting for the president to take the podium. You know, a lot of this was hush-hush until about yesterday. Uh, some of the employees found out very last minute about the president's visit, but they said that they were excited. They said that they were just honored to have the president come here and speak to them today. So they're certainly looking forward to hearing what he has to say. But so we'll be out here. Uh, we'll check back in with you guys probably about a half an hour. We'll, we'll send it back to you.